Hello and welcome. Let's talk about tetanus for surgery. So, what does it mean by tetanus? Tetanus is an infective condition caused by Clostridium tetany organisms leading to reflex muscle spasm often associated with tonic-clonic convulsion. Types of tetanus It may be generalized which is communist or localized or cephalic or neonatal tetanus. Now, incubation period of tetanus the times between the entry of the spore and appearance of first system symptom is known as incubation period, which is usually 7 to 10 days in case of tetanus. Shorter of the incubation period, the prognosis is worse in this case and more severe the course of the disease may be seen. If it is lesser than 3 days, it is commonly fatal. Now, clinical features of tetanus. In case of early or prodromal stage, there may be dysphagia, restlessness, unexplained sweating, joy stiffness, headache, severe pain in the neck, back and abdomen, and there may be wound pain. Active stage or stage of tonic rigidity includes trismus, which is the spasm of the masseter muscles, muscle spasticity, which shows the broad like rigidity of the abdominal muscles, research sardonicus, in which there is contraction of the muscles at the angles of the mouth and fontanelles, fontanelles and the opistotonus, where there is spasm of the extensor of the neck, back and legs to form a backward curvature. Now, stage of clonic spasm, laryngeal and pharyngeal spasm, respiratory fixation leading to respiratory failure. Now, treatment of the established tetanus. The general measures include isolation of the patient in quiet and dark room, avoiding noise and light, ATG and ATS, antibiotics like injection penicillin, injection tetanus toxic 0.5 ml intermuscle to deltoid muscle, IV fluid suit total parental nutrition, urinary catheterization, NGT with pass to prevent aspiration initially later for feeding, regular suction of throat, nasal oxygen when required, prevention of bedsuit formation, prevention of DBT by low molecular weight heparin, good nursing care. And the specific measures include IV diazepam, IV phenobarbitone, IV chlorpromazine, endotracheal intubation and ventilator support, tracheostomy if there is severe respiratory secretions, steroids, bronchodilators and wound care in case of debridement drainage and local injection of ATG. Prevention and prophylaxis of tetanus. The immediate surgical care of the face wound should be done by removing blood clot, debatalized tissue, foreign body etc. followed by immunization. In case of non-immunized patient, following dose should be given and with injured patient, booster dose within 5 years TT, no need of TT is there an immunized patient but no booster dose with 5 to 10 years, one dose of tetanus toxicity will be given and 10 years with no booster dose following dose is given. Now pathogenesis of tetanus. It is given here. The spores of Clostridium tetany are widespread in the soil and these are introduced to a wound site during injury and they get anaerobic environment in the traumatized tissue and they germinate into vegetative form. The multiplication of organisms with liberation of the toxin. These include tetanus, no spasmine and tetanolysin. These are absorbed by the motor nerve ending and there is retrograde transmission. And the tetanus spasmine binds to ganglioside receptor and blocks release of the inhibitory neurotransmitters. At spinal synapses leading to inhibition of the lower motor neuron by upper motor neuron, which then leads to exaggerated action of the lower motor neuron of the muscles like increased muscle tone, exaggerated muscular response, hyper excitability of voluntary muscles, involuntary contraction or spastic contraction. Now complications of tetanus. There is laceration of the tongue and buccal mucosa, aspiration, pneumonia, respiratory muscle spasm, laryngospasm, respiratory obstruction, cyanosis and asphyxia, intramuscular hematoma and vertebral compression fracture, laryngeal and phrenic nerve palsy, hypertension, rhabdomyolysis, cardiomyopathy, hypoxic cerebral injury, and death. Now, the differences between tetany and tetanus. Tetany means a clinical condition characterized by increased excitability of peripheral nerves due to low ionized calcium concentration in plasma. The cause is reduced ionized calcium concentration in plasma or alkalosis. And the clinical features include carpopedal spasm, stutter, and conversion. While tetanus is a wound infection caused by Clostridium tetany occurring in deep Contused soil contaminated wound infected with pyogenic organisms and contain foreign bodies. End of the topic.